Hello and welcome to Blickling Farm. It's a little foggy today and we are going... I think we harvest. And we haven't played this for probably a week or so. Maybe more than a week actually. Okay. The animals left mess. Should clean that up first. I think I'm doing... Uh, I'm thinking of getting... What do you call it? Um, I think I'm harvesting. And when you combine, I think I'm harvesting wheat from our number one field. A little unsure. I, I can't really remember. I think I'm doing. We're doing wheat currently. Clean this up first. We'll put this back over here, I think. Uh, let me check on the animals and see how much food they have. And I think they're quite, quite okay, actually. Uh, cows, they have the clean as well. Probably just what well, maybe takes a little bit to show up. See water and straw and grass and everything seem pretty okay. I think we are currently doing some harvest somewhere because the combine isn't there so I think it's over here on this video yeah, it's over there um, <coughs> currently harvesting number one field and after we're done with that we have to bale all this straw up which is good then we get straw for free so we haven't done a lot we're just in the beginning of Beginning of, it, beginning of it so so what have I been doing since last time we saw each other basically I have played a lot on an old map as you can tell by my feed I have played a lot on um, the Shalwa Michigan map and the reason behind that is that I Oh, it's not very. I found this mod uh, called Swiss Bank. There's another mod. If you go to what do you call it, the main farming simulator website, there's another mod mod that actually does the same. Um, I'm gonna see if I can find out what it's called. What could that be? Hmm. Could it be called? I wonder what what category category could be. Other maybe. Yes. Something like outside account now. Proceed for me, plans, down baler, so I can't find it now. I can't find it, unfortunately. Um, but it's sort of like... Um, if you look in-game, you can find it under, I think, beta. Could be on beta. Maybe it should be on beta then. What it could it be called? Package, map, object, trailer, tool, tool. Mm, I can find it on the website, but anyway, it's a mod that I think does the same thing. It sort of lets you transfer money from different save games. <coughs> so the reason I found not that ma mod, the other mod, the Swiss, uh, Swiss ma bank, which lets you move things between, well, basically creates sort of an account um, 
that's, that has to do doesn't have to do with the save games where you can, you can move money into, into that fake account then you can take get it back on another map so the reason for that was that I tried out this map which I'm not going to let do a let's play on uh, called Lone Star which is an American style map which is like it was quite nice actually I really liked playing on playing on it <coughs> but the fields are really big that makes them which makes them extremely expensive so um, the, the cheapest one of the cheapest fields are like a million at least and I don't have a million on that but I will take forever to make a million so I figured I could take some money off the shell raw map because I had a sort of like 600 grand or something there and then I started playing to get more money on that map because it's sort of set up for making money and then I transferred some of it um, to, to just the Swiss bank account and then I started enjoying myself so I've been playing on that map for quite a bit and installed new mods there um, the sawmill, the cardboard factory mod and a pallet factory mod and uh, also that, that led to me trying out the um, uh, what's it called uh, the greenhouse mods where you need pallets and cardboard to make uh, either strawberry or raspberry or the, uh, what's all the fruit eating you know. um, anyway so I'm trying that out and playing with that and, and that's kind of nice works out pretty good so basically that's why I started playing the show warm up again so and I have been really enjoyed that and um, I'm really enjoying it so I'll con probably continue that actually for now uh, we'll see I'll probably switch between maps I'm, I'm thinking of I'll actually do that. I think that's kind of fun. Switching between maps, not sort of getting st stuck on one map, just only. That's a nice screenshot. Otherwise, the idea between this, I, I, I said no. I remember from last episode. If you remember that from last episode of this, this let's play, I'd filled the, uh, filled up the, the silo with forge or chaff, and <laughs> I later looked on to look through the, the main website, the form simulator website, and there I found some really good mods for compacting which was made me feel sort of stupid stupid because I was looking for those and I think I distinctly think I actually talked about looking for those but I never actually looked for them well I did look for them I looked in the wrong place which means I didn't didn't find those the ones that were on the main website because I don't think I watched watch I looked at the main website uh, so, if you go to the main site, there's something called a rover rover system. It looks like in, in Sweden, it, it's an air, which is last letter of the alphabet, Swedish alphabet, which means it looks like a rover system, which would be more like ass system. I should translate it, but anyway, the rover system. You can find that on the main website. I, I haven't added a link to this because I haven't used it, but it seems pretty cool. It's has a, a spreader and compactor and weights and stuff so I think that could probably be a good way to compact compact it so almost up to say 600 I think is filled yep we go and just put it like so oh. where is my tractor over here Oh, a nice little, little, a oh, nice big JCB. I have emptied one, yeah, I emptied one load, I think, so far on this map. 
on this map, on this field, I'm sorry. The interesting part isn't this. Uh, the interesting part for me is number nine. No, eight. No, I did eight. Number nine. Because number nine, I think it's like potatoes. And I have no potato horse, so I really need to get one of those and rent one of those. Otherwise, as before, this is mostly about animals. I might buy some more of these, but uh, currently it's mostly about animals. And, and the cows, which we have 117 of, so that's very nice. Already 24,000 liters of milk, even though it's early in the morning. I think that's good. I don't know how how do you set the height of this, and I don't know how sensitive it is. And how does that work actually? I guess it works somehow. But, uh, so interesting how it works. Maybe I should see if there's a video around on YouTube, which which lets you see well uh, learns that you learn how to what the point of that is. Sort of what, how you set up header for a combine. And for people that grow up on farms, they're like probably, oh, damn, he's an idiot. It's very, and it's probably really simple. The whole thing is probably very simple, but I, ha I don't, I have no idea. Since I didn't grow up on a farm and have about zero farm experience in my life, I, uh, so I don't have a, a clue on what to do with it or set it up. I mean, get up and down, in and out, but don't really know why and how. Um, but if you try the Lone Star map, you'll see that it has quite a lot of American equipment. It's very much an American style map, with big, really big fields, um, and and they you, the ones you don't own, you can actually do actually do some contracting on which is kind of cool I made a pretty decent amount of money of one field but it took like two and a half hour to do so, so um, it might not be what you would do let's see what else it could be new if you look at the main farming simulator website you look at the latest mods uh, there's a fountain, like a water fountain, uh, something called the Fleming Land Roller. Uh, New Holland, which has the um, selectable colors, so we can select which color it has. Uh, a wood chip storage, which is placeable, which was very nice. Uh, I would, would have had... I was actually looking, looking for one of those. But I would, it would have been nice to have that when I started with where to put wood chips on the Chalwa map um, because I've done a lot of wood chips there harvesting our popular trees which it seems to be the fields never end it's like the most tedious sort of work ever to do it so in sections uh, I want to get it done because I want to sell the harvester because I, I can get some money for that and, and sell that and that, that could go into get, buy some fields on the on the Lone Star map, but uh, uh, the Clan Home app seems to be have been updated to version 1.2. I haven't done an um, episode on Clan Home in a, a bit of time. Uh, it's a really nice map, so I'll probably get back to it sometime. Uh, but it's been a few days, maybe a week, week and a half, two weeks. Time flies. It's, it's been updated to version 1.2.0.0. So um, I'm, I'm probably going to update it. Let's see what's changed. Um, we'll see. I might do a let's play after I've updated it. I'm still there. I'm still harvesting potatoes, which is also really boring. 
I don't find that harvesting seems to be a boring part of farming sim lately. Farming simulator lately. Not sure why. It's sort of the one of the points of the whole thing. To harvest, but I think maybe it just has something to do with the fields to getting too big, taking too long. I mean, the climb home map and the potato harvesting. Uh, the potato harvesting was a great idea to do that. I, if you haven't watched that let's play, you can see that I did plant potatoes on all of my fields, and. Um, it's really cool. I, I think it turns out pretty good, great with the potatoes. Um, but the potatoes take forever to harvest because the harvester is so narrow. And if you have big fields of potatoes, it will take a substantial amount of time to do fix that uh, or harvest that. I don't trust the JCB standing over there. I want to buy a bigger JCB. Might do that in the future. JCB, or maybe I would like to buy. I don't know. Caterpillar uh, Challenger, the track, track tractor. <laughs> mm -hmm. Ooh, well, it's not the most fun work, yes. I'm gonna scoop over to the silo, see how many, how much. Many percent fermenting it has done, if you can see that. I haven't done it's the first time I've done silo or silage silo on, on a map on FS 17, so I haven't ever, ever haven't actually tried it out. Empty this. So 65%, that's pretty good. I think it's read somewhere that in-game takes, uh, I don't know, what's it? Uh, doesn't take a, a very long time in-game, it's like six hours or something. Six in-game hours. Anything fun to say? Anything? Any news from from anywhere? Don't think there is. I don't think I have any good news. Let's check the other farming simulator sites. See if there's any good new mods there. Nope. Sorry. I didn't turn out very well. Mustn't destroy the crop. I'm a complete idiot. What else do you have? The Selby Farm Estates version 1.0. That's kind of nice, actually. It doesn't seem to be a very big farm. Selby Farm Estates. Seems quite nice. Uh, what else do you have? Peterbilt, Scania. Tractor, service vehicle. We're just looking at the f first pages of farming mods 2015.com. this in our silo so well if you played this map you know what a silo is and that hasn't have to, hasn't changed since 2015 so it works out it's the same place basically I think it got slow when I started looking at oh ah damn it <laughs> so I was trying to I think it sort of got very slow when I opened the website I just talked about, <laughs> I suddenly 
Well, one of the closest, but I missed the button and then I uh, was driving into a fence and such. Yeah. That's the way things go when you do several things at the same time. So it's over here. You just draw over, over this sort of netting. Net. You empty it. Like so. I think that's pretty much it for this episode. I'm gonna leave it there. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. Hope it uh, sort of was interesting for you in some way to look at it. Um, hope you didn't find it too annoying or bad or whatever. Let me go over here. Could probably get it like this. Uh, not a mixing station we have because we have mixing wearing mugs and so a seed station. So I'm um, think I'm gonna do this off screen until next time and then we'll do some baling of straw. Probably. We'll see if it will tomorrow if uh, I'll do something else for a few days. But anyway. If you like this channel, please subscribe. If you like this episode, please hit the like button, leave a comment, or share this video. So, have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye.